Alrighty, so let's go ahead and take a look at Escort's new Passport Max 2. This is basically the uh, previous Max, except now it also has uh, Bluetooth built into the detector. So, uh, now you don't actually need the live cable, you can just pair it directly to an Android or an iPhone device with the GPS unit itself, or with the detector itself. So, uh, we've got the detector right up here. This is the new Passport Max. You'll see on the label it here, it now has the uh, Bluetooth icon. Zoom in a little bit. So, see it right there. And then you can see the smart cord for it too. It is not a live cord. It's just a standard grade, uh, regular smart cord. And uh, we'll go ahead and plug that in and see it in action. Okay, let's watch it boot up now. Passport Max 2. There we go. And now you'll see the uh, Bluetooth icon right there on the left-hand side, meaning that it is now connected to a device. I currently have it hooked up to my iPhone. So, go ahead and take a look at that. And we've got it paired here with uh, Escort Live. So it's currently paired. You can see uh, Passport Max 2. There it is right there. And it's paired via Escort Live on the iPhone. And uh, with the new version of Live, you'll see uh, auto rotation works as well. So pretty handy there. We can go in and you know adjust the different uh, radar settings. Pretty simple. So we can configure everything now from the detector and get all all of our alerts and everything now through Live. Uh, so this is an example of just running it here on uh, the iPhone. And we're going to go ahead and do uh, Android here next. And to do that, I do have to uh, unpair it from the iPhone and then uh, pair it with uh, the Android itself. So this, I'm just gonna, actually let's turn this off. There we go. Okay, and uh, now we have it, uh, the Passport Max 2 hooked up to Escort Live on Android. So if we take a look here, you'll see it now says Passport Max 2. And uh, same detector, we haven't changed anything other than unpaired it from the, uh, the iPhone and paired it with uh, the Android. And now the Android works as well. So, Pretty nice, you've got uh, one detector for both systems, which is uh, really handy now. You don't have to buy a live cord specifically for one or the other. Great if you're ever changing platforms or just to simplify it. There's fewer, you know, dongles and devices that you need, so. Pretty cool, that's the main difference now between the uh, Passport Max and the Passport Max 2. It is specifically the uh, Bluetooth integration and cross-platform capabilities for both iOS and Android built into the new Max. Uh, all on one device, so pretty handy. Okay, so here's an example of a K-band alert here on the uh, the Max. You just saw it go away. Should come back here in a second. Alert. There it is. So this is just a speed sign up ahead. So you can see, there it is on uh, both the Android and uh, the Max. And here's an example of uh, the Max 2 running with Escort Live paired to the iPhone, getting the same uh, K-band speed sign alert right here. So yeah, and then as you can see, we can uh, either report it to the cloud or lock it out manually.